Hello everyone and welcome back to Aliasan, sometimes hides her feelings in Russian, episode 10. Today we are jumping right into this episode. Um, I do want to say like up front, up top of this episode though, um, two points of order really. One, um, I'm kind of testing a new camera setup so uh, I'm, I'm, you know, I was trying to test it out to make sure that there's nothing uh, screwing up with it, but if something screws up partway through this video, I apologize. I'm trying to get it to work as best I can. Um, hope so far it's it's working fine. So I'm hoping that it's going to continue to work fine. But just a heads up right away because this is sort of my test video at the same time as being an actual video. Um, and secondly, uh, there was no Oshino Ko episode this week, so I think I'm posting this a day earlier than I normally do with my Alia videos. Um, I don't know if there's going to be a video tomorrow. Normally, I do like to keep a video every day, but um, but Oshinoko kind of caught me off guard, so I don't know. Maybe I'll do a bonus episode or something else. I'm not sure. Anyway, um, we're going to jump into this episode. Uh, make sure to support the video if you can, liking, commenting, subscribing, and go to my Patreon account if you want the full-length reactions of these, early access, exclusive videos, lots of other great stuff, so go check all that out. But let's jump into this. Alia sometimes hides her feelings in Russian episode... Brain hazard? What's that? Got it. It's an anime. <laughs> <laughs> Alia sometimes hides her feelings in Russian episode 10. Oh, maybe I don't relate to it. It seems like he's not used to not being determined. She's calling. <laughs> <笑>急に俺の声が聞きたくなっちゃったか。やるよ。一人だとサボっちゃうって言ってたでしょ。It's <笑> Amazing. あ、いや、ペサレタイとかそういうド<笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> Damn, good memory. I can't remember some of my best friend's birthdays. That was a cute phone call. Nah. <laughs> oh, that makes sense. Cute. Cool. She's ecstatic about that, I think. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> I'm <laughs> Tell me your birthday. <laughs> oh. <laughs> A bit of culture shock. Damn. それじゃあ、まあ、お祝いしてもらおうかな。<laughs> That's cute to like throw himself a birthday party just for her sake. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, she's looks very nice in that dress. Yeah. Wow, everyone's just staring at her. I mean, oh, and you as well, I think. You are, you're, you look like an attractive dude, Masachka. <laughs> 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 
<笑>相手が諦めるまで。相手が諦めるまで。相手が諦めるまで。相手が諦めるまで。相手が諦めるまで。相手が諦めるまで。相手が諦めるまで。相手が諦めるまで。相手が諦めるまで。相手が諦め
my god. You came here in slippers only? What? Why are they coming back? Oh, wait. No, this is... Right, this is his mum. <laughs> I think so, right? Mm, this is good. Do I know this song? I feel like I've heard it once or twice, maybe. Nice. Okay, that was a pretty good episode. I didn't mind that. Um, it was a very cute episode. They focused a lot on some adorable stuff going on. Uh, especially, like, Alia was especially... Uh, Ford and flirty and aggressive in this episode. Aggressive in terms of like her, how how forward she was. Um, I and I liked it. I think that that energy was was quite nice, especially since I still do think Masachka is like a great protagonist for this sort of story. And so like he gets flustered, but he gets sort of like um, naturally flustered, like in a in a realistic way. It feels like. Um, and he, but he's still like pretty level headed and he'll play along with stuff. And he, it, I, I, I like that he doesn't lose his sense completely when he's flustered, you know, he's still like a reasonable dude and treats people in a reasonable way. I mean, he'll, he'll make jokes about, you know, he'll, he'll make some, some sort of like jokes like early in the episode when he was, when he said, um, uh, when she was like, well, if, uh, if I win, you do something for me. And he goes like, I might be into that actually. Like that's just, that's a sort of like just casual silly joke that actually I think is a sort of joke that I make with my friends sometimes. Cause it's funny. Um, and it, if, if you were around someone who you're comfortable with and they're comfortable with you, that, like obviously that's not a joke you make to a stranger but to someone that you're very comfortable around that's actually a very natural sort of <laughs> joke and response to make to me so um so i really like masachka because of that stuff but in this episode alia was really leaning into a lot of that teasing stuff and i think it was very funny and um and it was like a lot of this episode was reminding me of kaguya sama um and i'm not sure exactly what that is i think in this episode, Alia was acting the most like Kaguya from Kaguya-sama out of the whole series so far, in terms of she goes like wildly between she's completely in control of the situation to she's like really upset and pouty and stuff. But also the whole idea of like, I don't know your birthday, so I can't celebrate it with you. And that frustrates me. Like that's the same thing that Kaguya does in Kaguya-sama. So there was a lot of that relation there. And Kaguya-sama is one of my favorite shows of all time. Like one of my favorite anime of all time. So, um, so me comparing this show to Kaguya-sama in any way is a big compliment for the show. Um, but, uh, but yeah, so I, uh, I like, uh, I liked all of those, like, flirty moments in this episode. Um, I also, um, think Masachka, I like the characterization of him, because it does feel like this show actually kind of cares about his characterization. Some romantic comedies, I feel like, throw that stuff to the wayside a little bit, or the the character development the the male lead will get will just be like becoming more confident and be a, uh, being able to be comfortable around this girl more um but masachka i feel like has his own character development that's just like unrelated to alia which i think is nice as well so he's got this thing where like in the past he was like a you know a diligent student a hard worker and now he's actually like a little less motivated and he's like coming to terms with the fact that he's a little unmotivated and it's not like a, a an incredibly deep character arc he's not that bothered by it it's not upsetting him that much but it is something that they touched on in this episode a little bit um and then they also show that you know alia can be part of that motivation which i think is fun i think it's nice to focus on the characters like that and actually give him something to do other than just, oh, he, we're waiting for his next scene with Alia, you know? Um, so yeah, I, I continue to think Masachka is the best part of this show, which is, uh, other than, um, uh, I forgot her name, but my best girl. <laughs> it's sad that I forgot her name, but you know who I'm talking about. The girl that I, I've declared several times in previous episodes, she's my best girl. Nonoa or something, I think. Um, yeah, other than her, Masachka is the best part of this show. I really like it. Uh, looking down at my notes, hold on. Um, the His grandpa seems pretty cool. 
um even though he's weird as hell uh i like alia's mother as well but now next episode it looks like we're going to get um uh his grandpa and his mother so it would be his grandpa so the his this grandpa is his dad's father i imagine and then his mum's father is a grandpa that doesn't like him i think is what what's going on here uh if i'm following the family tree correctly um so yeah i i'm i'm curious to see how this confrontation is going to be because they haven't seen each other for a while the mum seems like she's a little bit of a doormat and it's unfortunate because like i don't think she loves the situation that her children are in but at the same time she's not doing anything to stand up to her father by the looks of it so i don't know we'll see uh but yeah anyway that's it for alia sometimes hides her feelings in russian episode 10 thank you for joining me make sure to support this video if you can liking commenting and subscribing and go to my patreon account for full-length early access and exclusive videos i'll see you next time goodbye